Hi everybody, it's Amber from Sweet Am's Cookies. In this video, I'll show you how I decorated these colorful butterfly and mushroom cookies with royal icing. I was inspired to make these mushroom cookies after seeing a video from Inspired to Taste. If you haven't seen her work, you should definitely check out her videos. And then I thought butterflies would go perfectly with these. I'm cutting the cookies from a chilled sheet of cookie dough, and this is my orange vanilla cardamom recipe. It's available to my Patreon subscribers. I try to keep the cookie in the cookie cutter when I transfer it to the baking sheet, so that way it keeps its shape. These will go into the oven at 350 degrees Fahrenheit for about 10 minutes. To decorate the butterflies, I'm outlining the wing in black flood consistency icing. This is 15 to 20 second count. If you want to learn more about it, you can take my online class Royal Icing 101. The link is in the description. I'm just working with one side at a time because we're doing the wet on wet technique, so I want to be able to get all of this done before the icing crusts over. I'll put a list of all the colors in the description. I'm using Chef Master Coal Black, Teal Green, this is Violet, and the last color is Deep Pink. While that icing is still wet, I'm gonna drag my scribe tool through it. I started with pink because I wanna get a little bit of color into the black to make those teardrop shapes. And then you can just move on to the other side and do the same thing. If your icing is crusting over before you have a chance to drag the scribe tool through it, you might want to try using smaller sections. So instead of doing two large sections like I'm doing here, you can split it up into four. This will need to dry for at least a few hours before you pipe the body. I let mine dry overnight. I'm using medium consistency icing and a decorating tip number five to pipe the body. And I'm using my scribe tool to help shape it and make it a little bit smoother. And then you'll let that crust over for about 15 to 20 minutes so that you have some separation between the head and the body. This icing will need to dry for another hour or two before you package the cookies. Now moving on to the mushrooms, this is white flood consistency icing. I'm using my scribe tool to help shape the icing and smooth it out. You can let this dry for about an hour. Now I'm doing a little brush embroidery on the underside of the mushroom. This is stiff consistency royal icing and a decorating tip too. Now I'm using a slightly damp brush to brush the icing up. This is adding some texture to the icing.
I'm filling in the rest of the mushroom with purple flood consistency icing. While the base layer is still wet, I'm piping some light purple dots. To make this lighter shade, I mixed the purple icing with a little bit of white icing. I'm tapping it on the table to just help smooth everything out. And then you can just repeat that process with teal and pink icing. And here are the finished cookies. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions about these cookies or any of my cookie projects, just let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching. Bye!